Hello friends, in this video, we will see another problem based on the alphanumeric sequence puzzles. Okay, so let us consider the alphanumeric sequence as R, E, 5, D, A, C, dollar, 3, T, I, Q, 7, 9, B, Ash, 2, K, percentage u 1 m w 4 star j h and n okay so based on this alphanumeric sequence we have to solve the following two questions and the first question is how many how many such ovals are there in the above arrangement in the above arrangement each of which each of which is immediately immediately followed by immediately followed by a number but not but not immediately immediately preceded by a preceded by a consonant consonant and the option a is none and option B is 1 and option C is 2 option D is 3 and option E is 4 so this is the first question and the second question is 4 of the 4 of the following 5 are alike four of the following five are alike in a certain way based on their position in the above arrangement in the above arrangement so we have to find so we have to find which one does not belongs to group which one does not belongs to the group okay so the option a is bk7 and option B is M star U and option C is DPE and option D is and option D is WJ1 and option E is 3QP and option 3 is 3QP right so how many such ovals are there so he is talking about the ovals first of all identify the oval so here we have e and a you know a e i o u r i o u are the ovals right so e a and i uh, b t k and u is here and then one m w so there are four ovals are there so what he is saying what he is saying there is a above arrangement each of which is immediately followed by a number but not immediately preceded by a consonant okay but not immediately preceded by a consonant so that means so there is no in the first there are three letters are there okay or three elements are there and the first i mean the middle element is what actually over okay and the but not immediately preceded by a consonant so here consonant cannot come so what will come here in the first space so number or symbol 
नंबर और सिंबल के इनका and it is also given which immediately followed by a number so here it must followed by a number so in the first it must not be a consonant and in the second it must be oval and at the end it must be a number right so here if you see e it is followed by a i mean it is preceded by a consonant so this one we cannot count here hey again this one is also preceded by a consonant but according to the given question not immediately preceded by a consonant so that's why this one is also false i so this one is also preceded by a consonant so this one is false so if you take here u so this one is preceded by a symbol and it is must be followed by a number so this one we can consider so out of four vowels there is only one vowel which is actually uh, which is actually satisfying the given criteria and the question so that's why the answer for this one is one answer for this question is on so answer for the first question is option b right so four of the following five are alike in a certain way based on their position in the above arrangement so we have to find which one of the following does not belongs to the group which one of the following does not belongs to the group right so if you see here it is bk7 right so where is b so b is here okay 1 2 3 k is actually after two position k is the actually k is after two positions and 7 is so one position i mean after one position to the left side so that means so from the right side it is moving three steps and from the left side it is moving two steps okay so from the right side it is moving three steps to get the next element and to get the third element actually it is moving two steps backward from the first element right so <coughs> here m star u where is m here and star is third three steps after 1 2 3 after three steps so from here to here it is taking three steps from left to right to move u m is here 1 2 so it is taking two steps left side okay so three and two steps three and two steps so next one is dp so if you see d here and p for p from d to p it is taking two steps right side from it is taking two steps and d to e so it is taking one two at two steps left side two steps left side from the d okay now wsj so w is here i mean wj1 W is here one two three, so it is taking three steps to reach J from left to right. Okay, to reach one from W to one, so it is taking two steps left side. Again three Q P, where is three here and Q is here, so again it is taking three steps from three to Q uh, from left to right. From three to P, from three to P it is taking two steps from right to left. Okay. so if you observe in this actually this third one i mean the option c it is taking two steps to the right side and two steps to the left side from d to get p and e but remaining all are taking three steps to the right and three steps i mean two steps to the left from the first character or the first element to get the remaining two so the option c is actually does not belongs to the this group so option c does not belongs to this group so it is asking actually which one does not belongs to the group so the option c is the answer for this question the option c is the answer for this question so i hope you got this one so thank you very much for watching this video if you have any doubt please leave a comment and please subscribe to my channel thank you